Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to get more traffic to your website. I'm going to show you how to go from zero visitors a day to your website to getting 300 or 400 visitors a day to your website. And you can achieve all of that in as little as 30 days. My name is Greg Kononenko. On this YouTube channel, I publish regular tutorials related to traffic generation, making money online and affiliate marketing. Click the subscribe button just below this video, tick the bell notification icon if you want to get notified about the next video that I upload to my channel. Thank you so much and let's get into it. All right, let's start out with a little example here. So let's just say that you've got a website dedicated to woodworking or construction or something like that and you might be promoting affiliate offers related to how to build a shed. There is actually a great Clickbank offer in that niche that you can promote called Ted's Woodworking. So if somebody types in how to build a shed, uh, then they will see certain results here on page one. And it is a reasonably competitive term. You can see there are lots of websites here, starting with WikiHow to Family Handyman, etc., that are talking about how to build a shed. So how do you make sure that your website has as high chance as possible to rank here on page one for how to build a shed? Well, in order to answer that question, we need to use some analysis tools. So let me show you inside Ahrefs the data related to this keyword, how to build a shed. So first of all, for how to build a shed, we can see that the keyword difficulty for that is 38. And it's not a very simple keyword to rank for. That's what keyword difficulty actually tells us. Now, the volume of searches just on the US Google is 14,000 worldwide. It'll probably be more like 30, 40,000 per month uh, searches that this keyword gets. So it, it is a great keyword and it would bring a ton of traffic for somebody who ranks on page one of Google, especially if you're in the top three, four positions. So let's now look at the analysis of the SERPs. I really like this feature in Ahrefs. And what you will see here is that I want you to pay attention to a couple of things. So AR is Ahrefs rank and that determines where inside Ahrefs ranking where the particular website actually fits. Now the key here is that the lower this number, the stronger the website is. So the best website in all of Ahrefs would be number one and the worst would be something like 100 million. Now what we can see here based on AR is that a lot of the websites that are here are very, very strong. Okay, they're 407. So number 407 in the world from the top is WikiHow, which is no surprise, of course. And we can also see that there is Pinterest, which is the number nine website in the world and other strong websites are in here. But what catches my attention and probably have, has caught yours is that there is a website called justthewoods.com, a hrefs rank of just 2.6 million and as you can imagine, this means that this is a fairly weak website. It's not a particularly strong website. We can confirm that also by looking at the DR, domain rating. Okay, and you can see that for WikiHow it's 91, so the higher the better for domain ranking. However, Just the Woods has domain rank DR of 34, so it means once again that they're not a particularly strong website. So why are they actually ranking on page one and how come they're getting all of the traffic? I mean, this kind of website, both you and I can build and we can create DR34 within just a few months. How did these guys do it? That is the question that I'm going to try and answer in this video. Okay, now the other thing that we will talk about in just a second is backlinks and domains. So what backlinks actually means is how many backlinks uh, and that's just links from other websites around the internet are pointing to this particular page, to just the woods. Not to the whole of the website, just the woods website, just to this page that's dedicated to how to build a shed. And you can see there are actually 33 backlinks from 13 different domains that are pointing to this exact page. That is a big part of the reason why, for example, this website is outranking medium.com okay so medium.com is a very strong website however as you can see just the woods.com comes up above medium.com article in the search engine result pages um, and that is because there are a ton of backlinks that are pointing to just the woods.com 
Okay, that's one thing. And another thing that you will notice that homedepot.com also is two positions below Just The Woods. Once again, because there are actually targeted backlinks pointing to this exact URL. Now let's analyze that. So if we click on this 33 and we analyze what kind of backlinks this website actually has, and I'm going to now look at just do follow links. You can see that this website only has six do follow links. However, those links are high quality and they are from articles that are very, very relevant. So one of them is from rockfather.com and it is an article, as we can see, about home projects, DIR ideas for home. This next article here is from a website and from an article which is about outdoor projects. Okay. So let's open up this URL and actually check out where the link from Rockfather to this website, to Just The Woods, is located. And what I can see is that there is an article on the Rockfather website which has got a link right here to justthewoods.com, to that article on justthewoods.com. So this one here, okay, we've got a link from the rockfather.com to justthewoods.com and that is what is helping this website, the Just The Woods website to rank on page one of Google for this particular term, how to build a shed. These are the sort of links that they have, they're contextual links, okay, and the link is very, very relevant. So you can see that this blog and the article on the blog is about the handyman's guide to building a backyard shed and they're linking as a reference they're linking to Just The Woods. Now the big question is, how does the owner of Just The Woods, how did they manage to get backlinks that we can see here from all of these websites? So how did they get a backlink from the rockfather.com? And how can you implement a similar technique to start scoring backlinks from high authority websites to also start getting your pages ranked on page one so that you can start getting traffic to your website? This is very important because as you can see, just six do follow backlinks. This is nothing, just six high quality do follow backlinks can make all the difference and they can help your page rank on page one of Google for a very competitive keyword with very high keyword search volume. Now guys, the answer to this is guest posts. You can put in guest post into the search box on Facebook and then narrow down your search to just the groups. So click groups here and you will find all of the groups that are related to guest posts. And this is where you can get backlinks often for free. You can get backlinks from other high authority websites backlinking to your article, to your link. And this is how you can boost your ranking very quickly. Often in less than 30 days, you can boost the ranking of your website to get from page two onto page one or from page five onto page one. Uh, it just depends on the number of links that you're actually able to get. Now, uh, let's take a look at some of these guest post groups. So the very first one, which I am a member of, is called Guest Post Free, Paid and Exchange. So as you can see, there are actually opportunities for you to get free backlinks from these groups. As I scroll through the posts here in this group, Guest Post Free, Paid Exchange, you will see that there are uh, different people posting about opportunities. Now, there are buyers and sellers of guest posts. So in this group, there are some people who own websites and who want to get links from websites. So there are both parts of the marketplace are represented here. You can see it says paid guest post available, niche education, permanent do follow link inbox for deal. So this person is actually trying to sell a guest post. Now, I want to say something here, okay? Google in general does not like paid links. So I am not recommending that you buy any links. A lot of people do this, okay? It, it is a big industry, but in this video, I am not recommending that you pay for links. If you decide to do it, it's, it's your choice. However, in this video, I want to talk to you about how to get these guest posts for free. So let's continue scrolling through and let's see what else is uh, is actually here. So somebody is again, um, is selling for $75, another link here, but we want to continue scrolling and scrolling and scrolling until we find something like this. We are accepting free guest posts with do follow link 
niches are business, travel, real estate, and more. All right, now, uh, Google guidelines don't say anything about uh, not being allowed to link from other websites to your website, okay? And this is where the opportunity is. So here is a person who will accept your guest post as long as it is a high quality post, they will publish it on their website and they will provide a do follow link from their website to any page on your website. Now, this is really, really cool because it means that you are able to score a high quality backlink, a do follow backlink to any page on your site. Uh, and this is not the only opportunity. There are tons, there are dozens, hundreds in here. If you scroll through, people are looking, uh, uh, you know, people are accepting free guest posts with do follow links. Now, why are they doing this? Well, for them, this is free content. For example, I have a team of writers and it costs me anywhere from $20 to $100 per post to create content on my post. If I um, accept a guest post on one of, my, one of my websites, this is free content for me. I'm saving money. It's like I'm getting content instead of paying somebody, you know, 50 bucks for content, I'm getting this content for free as long as it's high quality content. And if I get free content, why not? I'll, I'll give you a do follow backlink. This is the mentality of the people that are accepting these free guest posts. So this is one thing that you can do. You can get in contact with all of these people and you can pitch your guest post idea to them, publish it on their site and link from their site to your website. And that will in turn boost your website in the search engine rankings that will increase your domain rank over time as well. So this is a very, very high quality tactic. The other thing that you can do is you can actually publish a post in here where you're saying that I need a free guest post. For example, this person two days ago said I need a free guest posting website with 20 plus DA with instant approval. So you can make a post like that where you're saying I would like to submit a free guest post to your website in the niche of travel or in the niche of home improvement or in the niche of make money online. So, uh, and people will contact you and they will say, listen, I'm running a website, you know, do you want to post your guest post on my site? So there are the two things that you can do to start scoring these high quality backlinks. And don't forget, often all you need to do is just get, you know, three or four backlinks to get your page from nowhere to page one and to be competitive and to start ranking for these kind of keyword terms, how to build a shed where keyword difficulty is 38 and volume is 14. And um, using these guest post groups, okay, you can start getting these backlinks for free. All you need to do is just write a uh, content, maybe a thousand words or so, and that will give you an opportunity to link back to your website. Now, don't forget, this was just one group. Under guest post, you will find dozens of groups. You can join them all and you can get dozens, hundreds of backlinks and you can finally start getting this traffic that you need. What did you think, guys? Did you like this method? Then please leave me a comment below in the comment section and let me know what you thought of this video. Also, click the like button and subscribe to my YouTube channel just below this video. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video.